Hi, my name's Cherith and I'm doing Strive Diaries today. At the minute, we are all on social media a lot, lot more than we would normally be, which is really inevitable. And I want to talk through some of the things that I do to stay body positive while being on social media. So firstly, months ago, I unfollowed any pages or people that were promoting diet culture or that were promoting um, just messages that weren't body positive or that were saying you should be a certain shape and size. I just unfollowed them all and it was the best thing ever because now when I go onto my social media, all I'm receiving is positive messages. So if there's anyone or any sites or pages that you follow and after you see a post, you just feel crap about yourself and um, particularly about your body, then unfollow button and um, yeah, hopefully you'll see a difference on your social media. The next thing to remember is that if intense online workouts aren't your thing, then that is totally okay. If you don't enjoy doing them, then that is fine. Do not feel the pressure to do them when there are so many of them going around at the minute. If what you wanna do is go for a walk, then that is absolutely grand. I think at the minute, because there are so many people enjoying that, then, you know, also that is fine. Um, people enjoy different things, but just remember this pandemic is not about being the fittest you've ever been. It is about staying safe and staying well. And yeah, so do not give in to the pressure that's going around on social media and all the adverts and everything about intense online workouts. The third thing you can do is understand what diet culture is. Diet culture will basically tell you what the ideal body um, should look like. So diet culture years ago would have said that women should be stick stick thin. Today it says women should be like thick thin. So they should have like skinny tummies but thick hips. And that's kind of how diet culture has moved over the past decade. It also really heavily influences men as well as women in terms of how they should look. Um, a lot of celebrities will say that they are body positive, but then they will promote the likes of skinny detox teas or like diet lollies or diets that they do. And a lot of the things that they promote actually end up just giving you lots of... Um, upset tummies and the craps basically um but they will promote them as um they will get paid lots of money to do it another way that celebrities achieve kind of the ideal look that um um diet culture says we should have is by editing their photos by um having plastic surgery and so a lot of diet culture is really, really unachievable if you aren't a millionaire or a really famous influencer because you won't have the means to have plastic surgery or um, the um, money to get all your pics edited. So diet culture really is all of those things. It's how um, basically online um, people and pages and the kind of culture and movement of dieting will impact to you and it's very subtle uh, a lot of the time or a lot of the time it's really in your face as well it's it's very complex but it's something that um, a lot of positive pages will talk about and will address and um, so I think just growing your awareness of what diet culture is is really really important. One of the last things you could do to become more body positive online is to follow body positive influencers. Two of the main accounts that I follow are Ai Wei and Body Posy Panda. And I just find both of those people post really encouraging body positive messages. They're also involved in a lot of campaigns around diet culture and post a lot of interesting things regarding that. And um, yeah, they're just people that whenever I go onto their accounts, I always feel really uplifted and better about my body. Um, so yeah, that's it. Just a few things that you could do to become more body positive, to feel a bit better about yourself and to 
not give in to any of the online pressure to look or feel a certain way about your body. I hope it was helpful. Thank you.